Hey guys, what's up? So today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my self-tanning routine. This video is in collaboration with Loving Tan and to be honest with you guys, I've been using Loving Tan for close to like a year now and I fell in love with it. So I was really excited when we decided to collaborate with each other because uh, they ended up sending me a lot of goodies and products that I haven't used yet. I actually ended up trying them out for the last two months and I'm going to give you guys a little information on each one and what they're good for. There's some that are like for those moments where you can't tan and you're like so pale and you just need a lot of help. So yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys my self tanning routine and show you guys how I got this beautiful golden tan. Now I know it's a little hard for you guys to see it right now because I have like this lighting in here but I am gonna go downstairs and show you guys a little clip of my tan in natural daylight so you can see what it looks like but I'm gonna jump right in and show you guys my self tanning routine so the first thing I like to do is prep the night before I just like to prep the night before that way my skin's ready to go and I can like moisturize the areas that are a little bit more rough like my knees and elbows I also like to use a scrub in the shower and shave uh, the night before. If you shave the day of, sometimes the self tanner will kind of stick and like onto like the little uh, pores, like where your hair comes out. So that's why I like to do it the night before and use a really uh, gritty scrub. Recently, I haven't been using the scrub uh, that much because I do have eczema and my skin's very sensitive, so it's kind of been irritating me. But I did try out the glove that they sent me. This is the tan removing and skin polishing glove. And I love it. It's not too rough on the skin, but you can definitely feel like it's exfoliating your skin and getting the dead skin off. So you basically just wet it in the shower, put your hand in here, and it has two different sides. One's a little rougher for uh, like getting off the dead skin and stuff like that. And then the other side is for polishing your skin. And so I feel like I'm going to start using this a lot more because like I said, my skin is very sensitive and this worked really nicely. It's going to save some money because you can reuse this instead of buying... Uh, like the little tubs of scrub. So yeah, I really like this uh, skin polishing glove So this is my first check-in uh, I have no makeup on no tan nothing my under eyes are Slightly discolored and my face is a little swollen because I was cuddling with the puppies this morning But aside from that, um, I haven't been out in the Sun at all this summer. I went to the pool for like a couple hours in Atlantic City uh, recently but aside from that I haven't been out in the Sun all summer so I'm really really pale and I just wanted to show you guys a before of my face and what it looks like because I am gonna be applying this onto my face neck and collarbones this is what I look like before all right so I'm gonna show you guys a close-up of my legs this is my thigh it's usually really uh, like pale and dry I have really dry skin but I didn't put any lotion or anything on just so you guys can see what my skin looks like before and then my knees are always a little bit darker in this area right here and my legs are super pale to the point where it's almost embarrassing because i haven't been in the sun at all this summer and yeah this is basically what my leg looks like before i tan and everything it's just really really pale so i'm gonna go tan and show you guys what my legs look like afterwards so the next day after my skin is all prepped, I like to take my Loving Tan 2 Hour Express and mine is in the shade Dark. I just like the darkest one because why not? If you're gonna tan, like go all the way. But um, this is insane. Like this has come through for me so many times. I've gone to like graduation and tan two hours before. Uh, my husband and I's anniversary, I ended up tanning two hours before we left to Philadelphia and my skin was just so beautiful afterwards. So I usually feel like whenever I need to pick me up or I just look really pale, I just um, end up using this and it's so fast and easy to use. So uh, one thing I also like is it doesn't leave streaks. I know some tanners uh, are a little harder to blend, but this one's like very easy to blend out. And um, one thing I love also is that it has a olive undertone. So 
Some self tanners look really orangey and you can tell you have self tanner on but this one's really nice because it just looks so natural. It looks like you came back from vacation and your skin just looks so dewy and rich and beautiful and they also sent me a mitt which I already had purchased this mitt before with the 2R Express from Ulta so they do carry it at Ulta if you didn't want to order online. Uh, but yeah, this mitt is so soft. It's one of the softest mitts I've ever used and it's double-sided So I like this because sometimes I'll use one side to apply the tan And then if I feel like I applied a little too much or went in heavy I'll flip it around and just like buff it out with the other uh, end so I do love this mitt a lot. It does come in handy you guys can see right away there's a difference between my left leg and my right leg you can definitely tell that the tan is on and I like it also because when you apply it you can see what you're doing it's not like clear or anything so you know where you're applying the tan and this is honestly right after I just applied it I haven't even waited the two hours and you can already see a huge difference in my skin so second check-in and I'm really dark right now uh, this is a little over two hours you can wash it off after two hours sometimes I like to sleep overnight with it and let the tan develop a little bit more but this is after two hours, I look super tan. It's such a quick transformation and my face looks a little dirty right now just because I still have the tan on. Once I wash it off, it evens out really nicely and uh, it just looks like very seamless, but this is what it looks like close up and my skin looks so nice. Like you'll see like little uh, spots like this, but once you wash it off, this all comes off. But so far, it looks really nice. This is what my legs look like. They're super tan and defined. I'm actually gonna head upstairs right now and take a shower and wash off the self-tanner and then just show you guys what I look like afterwards. I don't have any lights on in my home right now. All the lights are off. I have a ton of windows in my living room, so I get a lot of natural daylight. But this is what my tan looks like. It looks really nice. And I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a close up so you can see a little closer what it looks like. It's so pretty and it looks so natural. And I don't know, I'm just really feeling my tan right now. It looks really cute. So they also sent me this little applicator which you can apply self tanner to your back. So if you're someone that doesn't have anyone to help you apply your self tan, this is gonna come in handy. So I did use this on my back. Um, I had already started applying it on my lower back and I forgot I had this, so I ended up applying the rest on the top of my back with this. But honestly, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use this all the time because um, my husband usually does my back and it's just like easier for him to do it I'm a little lazy when it comes to that part, but um, This is very handy if you live alone. You don't have someone that can apply it for you You can just pick one of these up and apply it to your back. So yeah, this is really nice I don't know. I'm gonna keep trying it out and see if I can uh, Find different uses for it, but this is like well thought out. I've never seen something like this for like self tanning so this is pretty cool so i just want to take a moment and share this product with you guys this is like my little magic bottle i love this stuff so much so we ended up going to atlantic city and i have a vlog up on my vlog channel if you guys want to check that out but we went and i didn't have any color to my skin i was so pale i didn't sit out in the sun at all this summer and i had like no color to myself and sometimes when i'm pale and i don't get any sun my legs are really bad like i get a little bit of a darker spot as you guys saw in the clips on my knees and the rest of my legs are so pale to the point where if i wear a skirt or shorts it looks really bad so I didn't have time to self tan because we were just like in and out of the hotel room and just busy so I ended up taking this with me and applying this all over my legs. This stuff is beautiful. I'm gonna just put some on my hands so you guys can see how this works. 
um, but I usually just rub this all over my legs and it's kind of like makeup for your legs but not really because it doesn't feel like you have anything on it just feels like lotion but it just blurs your skin out so nicely as you guys can see there and it gives it a little shimmer a little color and basically if you have no tan and you're in a rush you can apply this so this is called the bronze shimmer luminous cream instant color satin finish natural glow and the one that i have is dark for medium to dark skin tones and this stuff is just so gorgeous i don't even know how they came up with this but yeah if you're like pale or you need a little pick me up you're going out uh even if you already have a tan and you want to apply this if you're going out or something or have an event or whatever um it's gonna like boost and enhance the look of your legs and like blur everything out so yeah this is like one of my favorite products aside from their 2-hour express i'm like obsessed with this stuff and i'm just gonna take a little bit more and put it on my collarbones so you guys can see what it looks like so you can see there there's like a little bit of color to it and just watch this like transformation i'm just gonna look so dewy and glowy and so nice yeah, so you guys can see there's like a ton of shine to it and it's so pretty. And yeah, I just love this stuff. After I'm all like tan and golden, I like to use the Deluxe Gradual Tan. And like I said, I've only been using this for two months, but this has made a huge difference in making my tan last longer. So before my skin would be really dry and I would add lotion. But I just felt like some of the lotions that I used had a little bit of oil in it. So it kind of just um, didn't make my tan last as long. Using this, it has made it stay a little longer. It adds a little bit more of a tint to your legs and also keeps it really moisturized. And all of these products have this natural olive tone to them. So they don't, again, this doesn't look orange or anything like that. So I really like that about this product. I did use a tan a couple years ago and now when I look back at pictures, I feel like I looked a little orangey, but this one just looks so natural. Like as you guys can see, it looks like I just went on vacation or something like that, or I've been out by the pool. And honestly, I haven't, I haven't done any type of tanning out in the sun this summer. I like to stay out of the sun just to like keep my skin healthy. Uh, the sun's not really good for you like sitting out in the sun for a long period of time and it also creates a lot of sun damage to your skin like sunspots um, you can get premature uh, aging and wrinkles and it's just not good for your skin so i prefer to use a self tanner on my skin and just apply makeup to my face and that way i get like the same results except it's a lot healthier and i'm not like damaging my skin in the sun so that's basically my self tanning routine what i do at home to get this gorgeous tan i don't like i said i don't like to sit out in the sun i don't go to tanning beds anything like that so a more natural way for me to get uh, this beautiful tan is using these products and also one thing i forgot to say is i have really bad allergies to the point where i've had to discontinue or stop using certain makeup products because they affect my skin and my face and make me swell up so um one thing i do love is that i can use this on my face and it doesn't cause uh, any bad reactions breakouts or allergies. I know everyone's different So maybe just test it out if you get this or another product just test it out on a small um, Little spot on your face, but for me this has been working on my skin so I do apply the tan to my face and I don't know I just love this whole look it's a vibe i look so cute with the tan but anyway if you guys want to know a little bit more information or you guys want to check out these products i'm gonna link them all down below i hope you guys enjoyed this self-tanning routine video and yeah i'll talk to you guys soon bye